Hey everybody, I'm here today to show you and tell you how to play piano with both hands easily. This will be a piano tutorial for beginners, so let's get right into this instructional video tutorial. There are essentially four steps towards playing piano with both hands. And you can learn this whether you're an absolute beginner or not. My son and daughter, my oldest two kids, I have four kids, um, the oldest two are taking piano right now. The younger two, we didn't start them on piano yet because they're too young. At the time of me filming this, they just turned two years old. So, you know, you can, you're, you can never be too young to start learning the piano, but I just don't think they're going to be very receptive of it just yet. My oldest two kids are six and four and a half, basically, and uh, they're oh, uh, six, actually six and, a, six and a bit and almost five. Six and four, but you know, six and a bit and almost five years old, they're a lot more receptive to playing the piano because they're a lot older. They're decently older. So anyways, yeah, essentially my uh, oldest child, my son, Luke, uh, has learned how to play quite fluently with two hands. And he's like I said, he's like six, six and a bit, not six and a half yet, but uh, probably about six and a half. No, he's almost six and a half. Anyways, he's six years old and he's already learned how to play with both hands. So it's not that hard. But basically, you know, the piano teacher did a great job. Miss Caroline, I don't, I don't know if by any chance you're ever going to see this, but Miss Caroline, you're fantastic. She did a fantastic job at showing him how to play with two hands. But what I did is I took sort of the instructions of him learning how to play with two hands and I broke it down very simplistically so I could use it for a tutorial to explain like super easily. So the first step, I kind of broke it down to four steps. The first step, and sorry about the song intro, but it'll be worth it, trust me. You'll learn so easily. The first step is to play the same notes with both hands, okay, at the same time. So mirroring, I call this mirroring, okay? Identical, basically. So I'm gonna get my thumb on middle C over here, and my, my right thumb on middle C, my left pinky on a C that is an octave down, and I'm gonna play them at the same time. Slower, hold it, faster. Okay, that's the first step. Practice that, a couple minutes of practice, doesn't take much, okay? The second step is gonna to be to play the same notes on both hands like we just did, but different timing, okay? Different timing. So I'm gonna hold one note and I'm gonna sort of press the other, okay? And this is, the, this is basically like the first step, but extended to the second step. You're just gonna do the same thing, but different timing. So instead of going like this, you're gonna hold one note and tap the other. My show notes fell on the piano notes. My notes fell on the notes. But anyways, we're continuing on. So that's the second step. The third step is going to be to play this, do the exact same thing. But instead of just using one finger, you're going to use two fingers and you're going to play the identical note on two octaves. So instead of basically just doing this C right here, I'm going to do this C. And I don't know if this is on camera. Yeah, you can see that. I just want to make sure. I'm going to do this C over here. My, my, my thumb and my pinky together. Like that. Okay? step. Anyways, the fourth step once you learn how to do that is the same thing, but you're essentially going to be using different fingers to play complementary notes. So I'm going to do the same thing right here, but watch what I'm going to do. A complementary note for C is going to be like E and then G. So what I can do is just like this. Ready? So we're going to try that again. I'm getting a little bit of camera shy here. A little bit nervous. Stage fright. That's the word I'm looking for. So you see what I did there? It's that 
that easy. Learn to play with both hands, couple simple steps, four steps I broke it down for you. Literally that's it. You can obviously, you can, you can even you know, take it a step further. Sorry about that, I <laughs> messed that up again. idea. I'm playing standing up. There's no seat. I'm in my laundry room. It's a little bit, you know, it's not, not really an ideal playing situation. And I'm not the greatest piano player to begin with, but I'm, I'm pretty good. Anyways, um, hopefully you enjoyed the video. If you liked the video tutorial, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Let me know what you think down below as a comment. And of course, be sure to subscribe for more great videos just like this one. And that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.